If you always wanted to learn how to knit, this is the perfect kit. The Amazing Knitter will show you a very simple and unique way to knit. You can knit belts, brooches, headbands, bracelets, and necklaces. Let's learn the main basic steps. Wrap the yarn clockwise around each individual knitting pin like this. Wrap the yarn around the knitter's tool. Thread the end through the guide located on the side. Make sure the new yarn is above the loops around the pin. Now you're ready to start knitting. Make sure to hold the end of the yarn lightly around your finger to keep it from slipping off the pins. Using the knitting hook, lift the bottom loop up and over the knitting pin. This leaves one stitch on the pin. Move on to the next pin and repeat until all the pins have been knitted. When you are done knitting the pins, wrap the yarn around the knitter's tool and knit around again. As you continue knitting, you will see the knitted piece coming out of the bottom of the knitter's tool. When your knitted piece is long enough, it's time to cast off. Cut the yarn with six inches of tail. Lift each loop one at a time off the knitting pins Thread the end of the yarn through the loops. Pull the yarn tight. Tie a double knot at the end of your knitting project. To make a flower, knit a piece about 16 inches long. Arrange the knitted piece into small loops and stitch them together to make the petals. Sew or glue a button to the center of the flower. Then sew or glue the flower onto a brooch pin. You can also sew your flower onto a ponytail holder. Now try making a sparkly butterfly. To make the wings, knit two pieces five inches long. Arrange the knitted piece into two loops like this. Stitch them together at the center. To make the body, knit another knitted piece about two inches long. Sew or glue it at the center of the wings. Attach your butterfly onto a brooch pin or ponytail holder. To make a cool belt, you will need to knit about four feet of each color. Take the three pieces and tie them into a slip knot all at once like this. Braid the three knitted pieces together.
Leave about eight inches at the ends and tie them all in a knot. Thread the ends through the slip knot on the other side. Wow, amazing! 